Welcome back, creative coders. Today we're looking at CSS backgrounds and specifically background colors. Imagine you're making a digital masterpiece. The first thing you need is somewhere to make it. In CSS, that is any HTML element, and background colors are your paint. Let's start with the basics. First up, background color. This property colors our HTML elements. Here, we just turned the whole page light blue. Pretty, isn't it? You can specify colors using names like red, hex codes like hashtag FF0000, or RGB values like RGB 255, 0, 0. For a full palette, check out our CSS color chapters. Now let's color more elements. Easy, right? Each element gets its own splash of color. Sometimes you want to see through your paint using opacity. Opacity values range from zero, fully transparent, to one, fully opaque. Notice how this makes everything in the div semi-transparent, including text. To avoid making the text transparent, we specify that the color is transparent instead of the element. Here, only the background is semi-transparent, not the text. We use RGBA instead of RGB, so we can adjust the alpha channel, or opacity. That's your quick tour of CSS backgrounds. Use these tricks to make your web pages really stand out. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe to get notified about our latest videos. For more coding tips and tricks, keep it locked right here on w3schools.com. Don't forget to try out what you've learned in our interactive editor. Happy coding.